guys, you go Karina here, and happy Blessed Tuesday! So, today is the second day of the brand new week, and I hope you have your goals aligned for Christ. And I hope that you've been striving and constantly trying to do the best that you can for Christ every single day, using all your skills, your talents, and your gifts. I don't know how else to say that, but I want to keep on sharing that because it's really important that we not let it go to waste. And so, that's why it leads to the song that got selected today surprisingly because i first heard this song back in 2016 and i'm so saddened with how the artist herself christina grimmy she unfortunately she got shot to her death unfortunately during concert and that's when i first knew her and um essentially i came across this song i bet you don't curse god I know you're probably like what really like what is this and so essentially the song itself just speaks about how you know when you're going through any health situations hence this pandemic covid or any turbulence in the plane and you're like scared about your life you know and anything anything any trial and tribulations that you're going through in your life the first the first the first reaction people do that tendency is to blame God for all their problems. When their life is not falling to play, people are like, why God? Why do you treat me like this? Why are you making my life so miserable? And that's how it is. That's how the people out there are constantly, constantly blaming God for whatever is going on in their life. And especially when things are going well, they they don't really care about God. But then when it comes to things not going in their plan and not going well in their life that's when they're like god why you know so that's why the song really speaks about that very much and i want to put a message out there that when you're going through any trial and tribulations don't blame god for whatever that may be but rather to just persevere in the love and mercy to god offer all your sufferings and all your pains and all your burdens all in god's hands and God will grant you that power, that strength, and that ability to endure it all and to allow you to grow in virtue during that journey, right? And especially when, you know, this whole pandemic, when all of us are so in this time of waiting for all of our lives to just go back to normal in some degree, really, like, you know, all of us, some of us can tend to really just be like, why, God, why? But really... The more you complain, it's not going to do anything. But really, it's best to just focus on what you can do for Christ and how you can grow and how you can grow as a person and in your character and how you can grow in your journey closer to Christ. That is what you should focus on and rather not to focus on blaming God for all your problems. And that's why that message is so important that we should not curse God in every single way and for us to just offer up offer it all up offer it all up don't don't complain don't get annoyed don't be discouraged don't feel the sense of doubt that you're not good enough and don't feel that doubt that your life is what is withering away because your life is not pitch perfect all right don't do that because that's what the enemy is trying to aim for in every of our lives and each and every one of you whoever is watching this that is the goal of the enemy to discourage you from growing closer to christ that is the main 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 goal of the enemy whom in fact will never sleep until he gets the job done so really i love how the song really has that connection in terms of you know to people who are really going through this time of trouble and so that's why we should constantly unite ourselves in prayer to not become discouraged and for us to unite in prayer so that all of us will become stronger and deeply rooted in christ every single day so really i pray that you be well again thank you so much for subscribing to my channel for those that have subscribed and if you have not subscribed please do so which is right here and it greatly means so much to me from the bottom of my heart when you do subscribe to me it's it's all going to god it's all for god so i'm trying my best at the bar high for christ and so should you keep on striving keep on trying don't give up because during this time of waiting god's preparing you for the answer and god's preparing the answer for you always remember that so as i always have said in all my videos don't be afraid to be true warriors of christ
Bet you don't cause God when the doctor calls with a stern voice and the test results and he asks you to come in right away. I bet you don't cause God when you're on a plane in a turbulence and a pouring rain and you're hoping that you'll make it out okay. Everybody cries, we will fake the smile when your back's against the wall and your hands are tied. That's pain. Life hurts. There's a thousand things you think you don't deserve. All hope is lost when you spend it all and you just can't. you don't cause God. I bet you don't cause God when your child is gone and he ain't picking up the phone on this 2 a.m. on a Saturday in July. I bet you don't cause God at your bottom line and your credit cards are hard to climb and your don't know where you're gonna sleep tonight Everybody cries We all fake the smile When your back's against the wall And your hands are tied There's pain Life hurts There's a thousand things you think you don't deserve Cause God, when you're dying in bed, about to take your one last breath, and you're holding on before you say goodnight. Thus, babe.